Hello Pisces, welcome to my channel Surabhi and let's see what are the messages for you. And as these are general readings, they won't be resonating with each and every one of you. So in that case, please check your moon sign and the Venus sign. For personal readings, the details are given in the description box below. So let's see what is the message for Pisces. So we have the death and rebirth, the world, the ten of pentacles, which came out with the four of swords. So I'll just keep both of them together. The empress, high priestess, the nine of wands, queen of cups, the queen of swords, the ten of wands bottom of the deck we have the eight of swords okay so Pisces definitely this time period is a destined and a big time for you this is a huge time for you some major changes are happening in your life and you must have perceived it by the events which must have happened in the recent past in in your life so definitely there has been something here which sort of ended i should say or there was a big time change in your life certain events have happened which have really changed your life or your perspective to life or a particular situation in your life okay and it has really taught you a great deal of lessons and this was something which was destined to happen the way it has happened so there were major closures in this a chapter has ended a definitely a new chapter has begun and whatever this chap chapter is heading towards is a beautiful one so whatever has happened has happened no matter how painful it was no matter how bad it was no matter how ugly it was the changes which it, it has brought within you whatever lessons you have learned out of it they were really beautiful and it will bring you a lot of internal healing also and it is moving towards commitment a long term stable commitment and a new beginning here there is a potential of lot of growth here lot of abundance if it is a relationship it is committed it is long term it is grounded it is a big family time so i think there has been some major change here which has no matter how ugly or bad it was but it has pushed you in a direction of commitment okay somehow something has happened that in this situation it you found commitment or you got the commitment and which has definitely stepped up the relationship to a brand new beginning just keep flowing according to your intuition this is not the time to quit whatever this situation was this was something which was really long standing there were many times when you wanted to quit the situation when you wanted to leave the situation but right now what i feel is that you just keep on listening to your intuition go slow Go slow, be intuitive and keep moving in the path where your intuition guides you to be. Because here what I feel is there is a lot of emotion here. Slowly and steadily you will be able to come out of this phase of not being able to move forward. The fear which has created in your mind because of this event which has happened over here. What I feel is in this situation you will be able to come out of it slowly and steadily. Let me see what is this Queen of Cups and Queen of Swords because wait. so what I feel is that this situation was stuck since a long time things were just not moving forward whatever was happening in this situation which was it was leading to certain fears and anxieties which you were not able to overcome and move forward you would you are dealing with somebody of the, at the same page you are we have the empress and the emperor here and we have the king of swords and the queen of swords here so there is a lot of emotion over here whatever you what i feel is whatever has happened it can be a verbal clash between both of you because of some ego issues here it can be that also whatever was said and done was maybe a bit too straightforward a bit too cold a harsh 
ट्रीटमेंट वॉज डन और हार्श वर्ड वॉज स्पोकन हेयर मे बी आउट ऑफ एरोगेंस मे बी आउट ऑफ डोमिनेशन और वट एवर इट इज विच लीड्स टू द हार्ट ब्रेक हेयर बट दिस साइकिल सीम्स टू बी ओवर टू मी राइट नाउ द बर्डन ऑफ दिस प्रॉब्लम इज सीम्स टू बी ओवर देर इज अ लॉट ऑफ लव इन दिस सिचुएशन ओके डू नॉट क्विट do not quit there is a lot of love in the situation you may just need to correct the situation that's what i feel just give me a second one more thing which comes to my mind is that after this phase whatever you have suffered or whatever has happened in your life uh, what i feel is that you have started thinking a little more logically also it can be that also it has led to a, a little bit of self empowerment not being only emotional all the time just thinking logically as to how you are supposed to deal with the situation and how you can correct it and how you can unburden yourself out of the situation that is also one thing which is the lesson which perhaps you have learnt in this situation let me see what is the additional message for pisces we have the knight of wands the nine of cups and the 10 of cups so definitely there is as i said there is a lot of passion here there is love there is wish fulfillment there is commitment coming in this is a beautiful relationship the only thing here is that you need to work through this uh issue if there is any arrogance or fights or harsh words are being said so that you have already experienced and so you should know how to deal with the situation like this in future let's see what is the relationship card number 2 may be of some significance for you like attracts like if you long for more love be more loving so that is what the message is that if you really want more love you need to be more loving so the thing is that you need to give love to attract love and that is how you will get love so pisces that's all i have for you hope it helps and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel bye thank you